Welcome back to Metal Gear Monday. I am your host, Alex, also known as Solonis Dracone. We're gonna try again to tackle this little problem called the Blast Furnace. Yes, I know my X input controller is plugged in, you fool. Alright, let's see if we can make a better showing of this than we did the last one. So far, so good. Nothing like a little bit of FAMAS. Although we didn't have to go that way, did we? No, we didn't. Click, 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 click. Alright, let's see what this thing does. Alright, it's moving away. It's moving away. I don't know how much farther it's going to move away. Alright. This thing's clobbered me a couple times already. I think this is a good spot to just crouch. And you can see the little rat running along there, just to let you know that this is a path you can take. Yeah, that's right, rats. Just crawl under my butt. Oh god. Right overhead. Stop nibbling my ankles. Alright. There we go. We're fine. Okay. So now let's, let's be a little bit more not stupid about this. Let's just make sure that we know what's up. Anybody coming? Not just yet, they're not. Oh, downstairs, okay. Ooh, that's right up against the lava, that is. Alright, it's a safe enough spot, I think, down here. Oop, 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 hello. Oh, wait. No. No, no, no. No, no. No. That! Ah, damn it! Son of a... Ah. Alright. This is already gone tits up. Yep, yep, yep. Goodbye. Alright, I'm just... I'm, I'm running for the door. Fuck it. Let me in. Don't care anymore. Should have gotten the hell out of danger already. I don't like this. Let me go back outside. See if there's anything else out here that might be worth doing. That alarm is not for me. What's in here? Oh shit. It's very hot in here. Alright. Ow. Steam hurts. Okay. Good to know. Ow. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay, and someone's coming in here. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Screw that, screw it. Bah, bah. Ow. Steam bird. Okay, so that's one way through things. Looks like it's the elevator. Oh boy. I don't like this elevator. It's not the most fun place we could go. Let's just check around for maybe any sort of things. I can tell you, if we're going on the elevator... And if we're going to be fighting some fools, we're going to want our FAMAS. And sometimes you just need a good old-fashioned machine gun. Alright. Let's make a quick call. Let's just talk to some folks, see what they say. Otacon, what's the deal? If you take that cargo elevator down, you'll wind up in Metal Gear's underground maintenance base. Okay. Pretty succinct. Meryl... Just for laughs. Of course she's not responding. Master? Oh, Master's Master, better. You and I, we're nothing more than dogs, are we? That's not like you, Snake. Don't let what Sniper Wolf said bother you. Listen, there's not a soldier alive that doesn't question himself. And if there is one, he's nothing more than a murderer. But someone like Wolf, a soldier who's looking for nothing more than their own death, is no good to anyone either. Once she started to look for death, it was all over. That's how you'll end up too, Snake. Well, damn. Nastasha, come on. As long as the strategy of nuclear deterrence continues, nuclear weapons may be reduced, but they will never be eliminated. If you think about it, nuclear reduction does not mean much without elimination as the ultimate goal. I used to work in the DIA, 
I figured the only way to achieve nuclear elimination was to work from the inside to convince them of the ineffectiveness of the deterrence theory. Seems like you're pretty focused on that issue. Victims of nuclear radiation are a sad thing to see. And I have seen a lot of it. I have seen more than enough of it. I was born and raised in Pripyat, Ukraine. I was 10 years old on that day, April 26, 1986. You don't mean... Yes, Chernobyl. That is the day that changed my life and thousands of other lives. I live just three kilometers north of there. 600,000 to 700,000 people were evacuated. Over 650,000 children suffered the effects of radiation poisoning. Between 1986 and 1993, 12,000 children died. My parents and many others like them who helped in the cleanup died a few years later from radiation sickness. We must rid this world of all nuclear weapons before they cause more misery, before they destroy the delicate environment that keeps us alive. I will not allow this pain and anxiety to pass on to yet another generation. Okay, um, I, I get that she was a part of the Chernobyl disaster, and I feel real bad for anybody who did actually suffer through that. But that does not carry over into this, okay? The Chernobyl situation was a nuclear plant that a problem occurred and it basically exploded. It had nothing to do with nuclear weapons. It was nuclear energy, which is a completely different thing. So it's not apples to apples what you're saying there, Nastasha. Uh, I mean, yeah, there is nuclear fallout to be worried about, some pretty deadly radiation, but Hiroshima and Nagasaki right now are actually safe to live in again. They were the only places that nuclear bombs were dropped, and they detonated a lot of nuclear bombs over the Pacific, too, and trust me, there is nowhere near as much radiation from an atomic blast as there is from what happened at Chernobyl. So no, this is, this is not apples to apples. I'm sorry, but your argument does not hold water with me, Nastasha, as much as I feel for the people in Ukraine and that general area that did suffer from Chernobyl. It has nothing to do with nuclear weapons. Campbell. Metal Gear is straight down. Better move it. There's no time. The terrorists are ready to launch. Negotiations are all finished. The government can't cave into terrorist demands, but they're threatening to launch a nuclear weapon. They've made their final decision. Why is the White House being so inflexible? Colonel, is there still something you're hiding from me? Snake, please. Just concentrate on stopping them, okay? STFU GBTW. You know what? Uh, let me let me just give Mei Ling a call. Just cause why not save? What can I do for you, Snake? You can keep abreast of the conversation, girl. God. She's just not paying any attention to anyone. Snake, Leo DeRocher said, win any way you can. Nice guys finish last. What about you, Snake? Is that what you think? Is there anything that you wouldn't do to stay alive? You should think about that, Snake. I am just taking it from all people here. Only Otacon is the one who's not trying to ram his shit down my throat here. God. Alright, let's do this. Ugh. Everybody's like, oh, snake, you fucker. Oh, God. At least Master's okay. Can always depend on Master. Oh. Look at that. You guys are cute. Okay, so it's gonna be this way, is it? Hey! Why the fuck did you take my gun off me? Alright, alright. I am not having any of this. You know, I'm wondering if I missed something somewhere that... Don't... Aren't I supposed to get some kind of a... Some kind of a thing? Oh, I just disarmed. Why am I sucking? Alright. Fair enough. Fuck you and your particular spot that you're standing on. 
I'm serious, I think at some point by now I should have gotten my hands on some armor. You know what, I'm getting tired of you fuckers, man. Alright. This has got to end. Fuck you. That's what I thought. God damn it, man. These guys with their hardcore shit. I really should go back and look through all the rooms I haven't been in. I think I get one more key card. Alright, alright. Fucking jamming here, too. God. And the f cheap shit. God damn it. Oh, don't act so angry, Mei Ling. Alright, going down again. Oh, wait. We're already down. Suppose I should have heard that flipping thing. God, that is so cheap. Alright. That really ticked me off. What? <laughs> what a fucking... Oh, wow. It's mailing again. Okay. So they're, they're basically trolling us on this particular level here. Great. So there was a mine. Am I missing anything else? Oh. Look at that. Another elevator. Alright, let's just double check that we're not missing anything else around here. That looks like it could be important, but I don't trust this situation one little bit. I am almost damn near dead. I'm wondering if I should go back and start looking for stuff. I mean, it's a bit late right now, but, uh, you know, could, could be worth going back and looking for stuff. Because I think I know what's ahead, and that's not going to be fun. Better believe I'm crawling around here. I just got mined. Come on, toss me some rations here. I mean, I know I shouldn't have sucked that much balls at that fight, but come on. God. Oh, it's ravens. Damn it. Alright, let's say hi to Otacon. If you take that elevator down, you'll wind Yep, we heard this. Crows, ah. There are a lot of crows here, there were crows around, but doop doop doop. -doo. Alright. Yeah, we know what that's all about, don't we? God. I'll be honest, I'm not really interested in this part coming up. It's it's gonna be a hassle. It is gonna be a real pain. Oh, I'm getting a call. Snake, I've got something to tell you about Naomi Hunter. What about her? Is this conversation secure? Don't worry, the monitor's off. Okay, what's up? I was in the FBI too, you know. I didn't know that. What's your point? Dr. Hunter's story about her background, about her grandfather being an assistant secretary to Hoover in the FBI. Yeah. And then going undercover to investigate the Mafia in New York. Yeah, what about it? It was all a big lie. What did you say? It was really bothering me. Why would she lie about it? She lied? She might be a spy. Ridiculous. Come on, even a high school student could see past it. The head of the FBI at that time, Edgar Hoover, he was a well-known racist. Didn't Naomi say that her father was Japanese? Yeah. Well, back then there wasn't a single Asian investigator. Also, in the 1950s, the undercover mafia sting operations hadn't even started yet. They first started in 1960, in Chicago, not New York. But. You better check it out. The chief and the president mysteriously dying, and that ninja? Too many strange things are happening. 
Are you saying that Naomi might be behind it? I don't know. Either that, or she's working with the terrorists. Could it be? If I find out anything, I'll call. In the meantime, be careful. Ooh, suspicious. Let's confront her. Naomi. Colonel, where's Naomi? I'm right here, Snake. What is it? Oh, uh, nothing. Forget it. Strange. Snake, by now those terrorists have finished their launch preparations. Stop wasting time. Well, fuck you too. I don't want to talk to Nastasha. She's all she's in a preachy mood. Let's just get down here to this frozen ass corner of the world with our tiny little sliver of health and no absolutely no way to do what we're about to do without taking some damage. Uh, oh, rations. I'll take them. I will take rations all day long, all day every day, twice on Sundays. So, I don't get much out of this now, do I? I'd really be smart if I went back and started looking around for shit, wouldn't I? Hmm, well, I'll do what I can. Let me save with Mei Ling once. Mei Ling, how's Naomi? Hmm? She's fine, I guess. What's up? Oh. What do you want, Snake? If you want to talk to Naomi, why don't you call her? Oh, it's nothing. Forget about it. Strange guy. You getting jealous, Mei Ling? Aw. Oh, strange guy. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Good luck. Any more words? Oh, thank you for sparing me. All right. God, everybody in my crew is a dick right now. Uh, cue the cutscene. This is the end of the road for you. Right, my friends? Listen, they agree. Ravens aren't scavengers like most people think. They're simply returning to the natural world, that which is no longer needed. Sometimes they even attack wounded foxes. You were the one in the M1 tank? Must have been a tight fit for a big boy like you. <laughs> But that was no true battle. The Ravens and I were testing to see what kind of man you were. The judgment is decided. The Ravens say you are a true warrior. Shh. Am I hallucinating? I can't move. The Raven has put the mark of death upon you. Blood from the east flows within your veins. Ah, your ancestors too were raised on the barren plains of Mongolia. Inuit and Japanese are cousins to each other. We share many ancestors, you and I. I don't have any crows in my family tree. <laughs> you jest, but indeed ravens and snakes are not the best of friends. Nevertheless, you will make a worthy adversary. You live in Alaska, too. You know of the World Eskimo Indian Olympics? Yeah, I know it. Must be a real threat in the muck duck eating contest. Yes, you are right. But there is another event that I excel at. It is called the Ear Pull. It is an event where two opponents pull each other's ears while enduring the harsh cold. It tests spiritual as well as physical strength. You want to pull each other's ears? The form is different, but the spirit is the same. Rejoice, Snake! Ours will be a glorious battle. This isn't glorious, it's just plain killing. Violence isn't a sport. Well, we'll see if there's iron in your words. Fuck. He's got- oh, he's a minigun haver. Uh, as I recall this battle, it's pretty damn hopeless. But we can at least see where the big fucker is. 
Yes! Got him a little bit. Alright. I guess I'm not feeling too bad about this. He's facing the other way. Yeah! That's how you fight a big man with a gun. Really? I could get up there? Ooh, I could also do Stinger Missiles on him. That's neat. Right. Oh, where you at, buddy? Okay. That's fine. Where the hell are you? Oh, he saw it. Alright, we gotta play a careful game of cat and mouse here. Careful, careful game, because if he's gonna turn this way, then I might be in a little bit of trouble. Yep, 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 he's coming this way. Aha! You know what? My grenade might be useful here. Yeah! Oh, this is easier than I thought it would be. Nope! Oh, nope! Spoke too soon! Fuck, 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 and it's about to explode! Goddamn! Ow! Get me, get him! Fuck him! Okay. Woo -hoo -hoo. Damn it. Okay. We in trouble. We got a problem. Oh, hello. Hello, Ration. I will gladly take you. Where are you at, big buddy? Hello. Alright. Stinger missile. <laughs> okay. You can have a lot of fun with this fight, actually. Where are you at, big boy? You look like... Ooh, 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 ooh. He's moving quickly now. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, 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 damn. Get, get, get the fuck camera. Wee, woo, 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 woo. Nope, 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 nope. Ah! Uh. Okay. Alright. He knows what's up. I'm gonna grab as many flipping things as I can. And they're just letting you use anything you want in this battle. Did you just take damage from somewhere, man? Oh, don't come this way. Do not come this way. Don't tell me you're knocking down boxes. He's going around. It's no longer safe to be where I am. Damn. Damn. Damn, damn. He is knocking down boxes. He is going all sorts of insane here. Stinger missiles may no longer be a viable option. Nope. Oh, well, maybe I can manage with some Nikitas. That seems to be kind of what they want you to use here. Didn't work. Okay. I might have to consider Claymores. Because I know he's going to be coming this way sooner or later. Let's see. Maybe we can entice him. Oh, crap. Damn! That was especially dumb. Stop running.
Nope, he's coming where I am. I'm out of here. Damn! Alright. <sighs> Tough battle. Tough battle if you don't know what you're doing, especially if he starts running. Yeah, gotta think about this strategy. Now, it would be a good idea, possibly, to try using some C4, because with C4 you can control when that goes off. So that might be a worthwhile strategy. There's a lot of things that could work well in this fight. You never know what they're going to be. Oh, all right. Let me let me ponder this for a moment. The uh, stingers are of limited use. The grenades as well. Let me... I'll see about trying to set up some C4. I understand that that's pretty... Uh, it's pretty effective. It can be anyways. Just getting the hell out of this. Alright. And see if I can just entice him to run this way. Although I don't trust this. Let me shoot a stinger at him. Alright, still got a C4 over here. Did you not just see where I was, man? Hi. You coming this way? You coming this way, big boy? Yeah, come this way, big boy. Come on. You saw where I was. Oh, you want to come down here, maybe? Hello? Hi. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. Boom! Oh, nope, took took damage, didn't didn't need to. Come on this way, then. No? Damn. No! Bad, bad, bad. Okay. Okay. I have got to get a sense of what to do here properly. Because it has been way too long since I've done this, and I wasn't all that good at it to begin with. Yeah. Damn. Didn't do anything. Might as well set off that other C4. Pop a ration. This can be done. This can be done, but I just have to be careful about it. Alright, and is it worth checking in with these pokes? That room is still under construction, because their main priority was to finish Metal Gear's underground base. But the good thing is, with all those containers, it should be easy to hide, right? Yeah, fair enough. It's, it's going to be a game of cat and mouse. So I have at least partial, partial protection here. Nope. He saw where I was. I wonder if I can set a C4 over here. No, that's a Claymore, damn it. Yeah, you, over here, see me. Hi. No, don't, don't shoot me, just see me. Come on, keep going. Yeah. Can I get off a stinger? Nope. Can you see me? Come on, big boy. Why am I looking through a gas mask? That is stupid. Mm -mm. Better off with my mines. Keep my mine on my money, and my money on my mine. Did I run out of... Okay, I shouldn't have run out of pineapples. Ah, come on. Why do you have to throw a grenade like a chump? All 
Alright. I have got to think about how I want to do this. Big man is going all over the damn place. Damn it! Ugh. Stop it. Come on. You re I have got to figure out how I'm going to do this. I need to be laying mines here and there. I need to be prepared properly for this. This really kind of is a stage in the game where you've got to be using grenades. There's really... grenades, mines, all the things. And if I had body armor, I might be lasting a little bit longer. Nikita missiles help, but the problem is that you stay vulnerable for too long a period. You have to stand in the exact same spot over and over, and you don't know whether you're about to hit a problem. Okay. Hi. Yep, yeah, that's right. Come this way, big guy. I should probably put on the mine detector so I can know where my flipping mines are. Yeah? Yeah, you like that? Let me just collect my mine. Looks like he's coming this way. Ooh, he's right there, too. Yeah. Hey, big buddy. Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. Keep going. You are right on top of it. Oh, yeah. Mines, baby. Mines all the way. Oh, wow. He dodged that crap. Alright, well, it's very clear that Claymore Mines are the ideal way to do this. They're just so much better than any other option. Because you can be sure that he's going to be coming around a corner at any point, and if you are okay with him potentially being about to run into you, then yeah, it can be very much worth it. Alright. Hi. You gonna look my way, man? Just gotta kinda of figure out where he's going. He looks like he's heading this way. Oh. Yep, yep. Oh yeah, he fell for it. Good, good, good. He's heading this way. Come on. Ah. Oh, he got me. That doesn't necessarily... Oh, my God. I was that stupid. Mm. All right. Not giving up on this one. I got, I got the right mojo down. I have just got to be smart about it. Smarter than I have been. Let's just go get our crap again. And maybe save after we go in there. Gonna need to heal up. Should be... <laughs> kinda need more rations in this. Alright. Da 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 Get my claymores ready. Get my uh, get my mine detector ready, and be ready for this guy. Come on! Oh, you asshole! Come on! Keep going! Keep going! Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's a good couple of hits right there. 
So he's he's going to go around and start firing at random shit. I'd better just, you know, get what life up that I can. Come on, you going to come this way, buddy? No, you're not. Okay. Better remember where my shit is, though. Stinger. Got him. Put back on the Claymores. This is a this is a fast and hard battle right here. This is designed to get the blood pumping. That means he knocked something down. Which way you coming, big boy? Alright. Let's see, you coming this way? Oh, you're totally coming this way, aren't you? Yep, yeah, yep. Come on, keep going right, keep going right. Do not, do not head south. Yes! And did he just force me into picking up my own damn thing again? He did. Alright, well... I can't escape over here anymore. That means that things are a little bit better apportioned. Nope. No? Okay, so I'm relatively safe right there. And there's not really many other places he could go except that flipping way. Damn it. He's moving too fast now. You know what? I'm just going to set up a small perimeter of well-placed mines. And if he just if he decides he's going to come this way, then at least I'm covered to some degree. So just set a trap for him. One way or another, he's gonna be coming this way, right? No, he's not. Are you kidding me? And he just waltzed over my mind. Oh my god. How do I end two episodes in a row sucking this badly at a boss? Mmm. Alright, one more try, and if that's not going to work, then I'll just do it at the beginning of the next episode. I am not on form this week. I don't know what it is. Oh my god. Probably could use that armor. I'm pretty damn certain there's an armor in this game that you should be able to get actually fairly early. Claymores are the best option though. They are the best option. Okay. Damn it. Put on my mind detector. Alright, that's enough of this. <laughs> I am clearly not on my game today, folks, and I do not want to, uh, I do not want to keep on boring you with all these fails, so I'm gonna, gonna get my mind together, I'm gonna get back in the game, and I'll see you next week. Uh, thanks for watching. Once again, I am Alex, also known as Solonis Dracone. This has been Metal Gear Monday. Have a good evening.